Hey, Justin here with STL Tones, and in this video, I'm gonna show you some more updates in Control Hub 3.0. So if you've used Control Hub before, you'll recognize that all of the modules sit here at the bottom and it's scrollable so that you can see all of them. Now over here in the bottom left will be your unused modules that you can add to your chain. So actually here, let's just remove all of these modules and you'll be able to see that they are all within this chain. And we have this handy search bar. So let's say I just want an EQ. I can just grab that first EQ and you'll see if I double click, that's how I can add a new module. I can also click and drag to add the module and, and add it in a specific place. If I double click it, it's always going to be the next available slot. So this works the same even if I load an artist preset. So let's go to this snare preset from Cameron Webb. I can also click and drag and add any module that I would like in any order of the chain that I would like. Another major update to Control Hub is that we now have a limiter view. So if you have a limiter in the chain and you click the header, this will switch the audio analyzer to the limiter view. And if I play audio, you'll see that it scrolls and you'll be able to see exactly what the limiter is doing as I pull down the threshold. This gives you a very precise look at exactly what the limiter is doing to your audio. You can also go up here to the right hand corner and you can decrease the scroll time so it takes a little bit longer to go across the whole screen and it's a little bit more broadband. Obviously this doesn't impact the sound of the limiter, it just impacts the view. Now just like we have the new limiter view, we also have the clipper view, which is very similar. So as you can see, I have audio playing and as I drag down the clipper, you'll be able to see exactly where the audio is getting clipped. You'll also see as I go from a hard knee to a soft knee, how the clipping characteristic changes. All of these graphic improvements in Control Hub 3.0 are designed to help you mix faster and more precisely. Thanks for watching this quick look at Control Hub 3.0. This is a free update to all Control Hub users, so head over to stltones.com and grab your copy.